Today I'm going to show you how to make the perfect cup of English breakfast tea. So to start out, we're going to need, of course, a mug and a teapot. I use these little metal ones. They're very convenient, easy to clean, and uh, they're quite inexpensive. I, I recommend them. They're very good. Followed by some loose leaf English breakfast tea. Some cream or milk, in this case, 2%. Some granulated sugar. And of course, a teapot. To start out, we're going to load the tea ball with approximately one teaspoon worth of English breakfast loose leaf tea. I get my loose leaf at my local bulk tea store. Shout out to Butterfly Herbs in Missoula, Montana. If any of you are there, I highly recommend stopping in. It's an amazing place. Once the tea is loaded in, all you have to do is seal up the tea ball. And now it's ready for brewing. Next, we're going to bring in our teapot. Lower in the tea ball letting the chain drape over the side so we don't lose it in there. And then we are going to add our freshly boiled water. This should be nice and hot, and so if it isn't boiling, it should be just shy of it to make sure that the tea brews properly and you achieve the correct flavor. From here, you want to allow the tea to brew for three to five minutes. And it's always a good idea to move the tea ball around from time to time while it's brewing, uh, just to ensure that the tea leaves are circulating through the water properly and you extract all that amazing flavor. Once the tea is finished brewing, or you have achieved a very nice solid burgundy color, we are going to remove the tea ball. And set the tea aside while we get the mug ready. Traditionally, you pour in the cream before the tea. It doesn't really make a difference. Next, you pour in the hot tea and the two of them blend together seamlessly into a delicious tan color. Next, add a couple pinches of sugar, or a bit more if you like, until your desired level of sweetness is reached. And just like that, you have the perfect cup of English breakfast tea. Cheers! Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss any of our future videos. You can also find additional content on our social media and blog.